here, guys. I am in Colombia. Uh, I spent a lovely 48 hours traveling. And now this is my second day in Medellin. Medellin? Yeah, is that the it. pronunciation? Yeah, yeah, you got it. Yeah, oh, it's cool. Seb lives here. Uh, you might remember Seb. But yeah, oh, so you I'm this here. Done. First time seeing Seb in six months. Very cool. But yeah, Very yesterday. Good to see you. Yeah, that's no, good to see you. Good effort coming over. Here. <laughs> it's done well. Yeah, no one yeah. else has made it so far. You're the first. I know. I know. Yesterday, got some food. I was very impressed by the quality of the food. It was almost as good, if not better, than Wellington, which is something I never thought I'd ever say. Because like, you go to the other cities, like, like you go to Melbourne, right? Which everyone's like, oh, coffee's so good, food's so good. It's so good, coffee central for Australia. It's not that good, Wellington's better. But the French toast yesterday, and the pizza yesterday, it was... I try, I try with those recommendations. Your recommendations, you extremely good. Small. And it's like half the price of what you're paying Wellington Half as the well. price of Wellington, double the quality. Well, what are we doing today? Start the day, grab some coffee, a little yeah. bit of planning. Oh. Take a train into town, have a walk around the CBD, maybe take a metro cable for the view. Sounds good. Don't get run over by car. <laughs> yeah, that would be good. Which is a very real possibility. This looks so good. So, first, I've never had a Chemex before. I drank like a lot of other drinks. Coffee, but it's good, very clean, very good. That looks so good. I said I wasn't having breakfast today. <laughs> there I am. Really, it's like the new life line today. Like, Never left Wellington. Food is very good. That's what I've been thinking for six months. <laughs> yes. No, don't speak English, it's kind of give away. Had a great cup of what I believe was a Colombian single origin. I presume I think, it was. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah. It is. yeah. 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 It's definitely it was... single origin, at least from one state. One, right. One state, yeah, each bean is like from a different state. This is like, this is the place of coffee I have. Well, it's the place of coffee. Yeah. That's like the entire reason I came here, guys. That's, I, I, wasn't, I wasn't interested in any sort of like cultural experience, so I was just just interested in the just coffee. Interested in the coffee. It's, and, it's me though, more or less. <laughs> so I think we're off to the city now. Off to the city, catch a train, catch some more adventures. <laughs> So we just rode the train and we got the metro cable. The metro cable is literally like a commuter gondola, right? And there's like how many lines? It's five of them. Five lines. That's pretty that's pretty incredible. Yeah, the cables are like the symbol of Medellin's revival. It's real interesting and it's certainly a very novel way to get around. Yeah, it's novel. Medellin was actually the first city in the world to use cables for, for public transport. Yeah. yeah. It's real interesting. Now it's like it's a thing of yeah. other countries. It's real quiet once you like when you're on the line. Like quieter than a train or anything like that. The scale, like the video doesn't really do it justice, but like the scale of this city and like the city's like built in a valley, the scale is just like unfathomable. But I've been to like the big Australian cities and stuff, so this is something else. It's yeah. The the video doesn't do it justice. It's just like hard to explain like how big it is. Because like what you see like is just like one side and it's just like that for like kilometers and kilometers on both sides when you're on the train and on the metro cable. It's pretty, it's pretty amazing. I love that translation. Do not pronounce or bustle again. <laughs> a few moments later. I will never say a Wellington train is full of game. You know, every so often you see that star story that's like, 
Your yeah, pink light sad dudes. Yeah, that, you wet. Yeah. You wet. <laughs> it's like not even peak hour. It's just middle yeah, of the it's day. like middle of the day. been walking through the city in Medellin. It's mostly just like markets and stuff, I don't know, the area that we just went through. Yeah, markets, stalls. A lot of football jerseys, that seems to be the, the hot item. Yeah, well it's Copa America this week, yeah. so yeah, need to get amongst. And that concludes the Medellin city vlog. It was really interesting to see the area that um, I've been staying in, the area that Sev lives, is definitely one of the better off areas in the city and going on the metro cable and seeing the rest of the city and seeing the way people live, it does, it gives you some perspective that I guess as someone who lives in New Zealand and hasn't really done a huge amount of travel, you don't really see how I guess the majority of people in the world live. My understanding is the reason that the metro cable was built um, in 2000, starting in 2004, was that the metro cables do go to a lot of the poorer areas in the city, um, and those are areas which, by road, due to the hilly geography, um, are really time consuming or challenging to access um, from the city. So with the metro cable it's a lot more easy for people uh, living in some of those areas to access the city. And I believe that's one of the things that the government has done here to try and make um, the country more equitable or the city more equitable. Um, and yeah, it's really interesting to see. And like there's only so much you can say but like the, a lot of the most interesting things are the stuff that we didn't see, on, I didn't capture on camera. But just observing the way that people live and the, what the lifestyle is like here. I essentially speak no Spanish, but they're all very patient. There's no rush. It's really nice. Yeah, everyone's really nice. And yeah, it's it's been really enjoyable um, the last two days here. Yeah, so I'm here for another two full weeks. So hopefully I'll have a lot more content for you. Uh, Seb and I are only in Medellin for a couple more days and then we're gonna go explore some other parts of the country. So you can look forward to that. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next episode. Kaki guys. Have a good one.